To keep coasting now and talking about schools, sports, infrastructure, the Infants of them Old Boys Association, MOBA, has handed over an artificial football turf constructed at a cost of 1.6 million CDs to the Infants of them School in Cape Coast. The turf, a FIFA standard football pitch with an eight year minimum guarantee, is the second phase of a proposed four phase Kwabuchi Center for sports excellence project being sponsored by MOBA to facilitate sports development in the school and other schools within the Cape Coast metropolis. The first was a 1.2 million series basketball court adjacent to the turf and the third will be an international standard eight-lane athletics track expected to be completed later this year. The commissioning of the project was marked by an exhibition football match between the lead sponsoring year groups MOBA 91 and MOBA 92, who were respectively sponsors of the project last year and this year. The match ended 3-1 in favor of MOBA 92, followed by a thriller between the Infante Prem School and Adisada College, with the former winning by two goals to one. The project manager, Mr. Kofi Isolapia, described the initial stages of the project as daunting and commended the old boys for their commitment and pledged to support the next phase almost immediately. The Abusia Payne of MOBA, Captain Paul Fojo, said plants are afoot to institute a management body to maintain and raise funds from the facility. The headmaster of the school, Reverend Ebenezer Aidu, expressed appreciation for the project with a promise to ensure proper maintenance of the facility. The CEO of Masia Santikotoko, Nanaya Wamponsa, encouraged schools in the region to build synergies through memoranda of agreements to develop sports together since resources were difficult to come by. I will encourage all other schools uh, to go this way to ensure that we are providing the right facilities for our students to perform. Uh, gone were the days where Ghana was dominating at the youth level of football and it was all due to the fact that we had a lot of those players playing for schools, especially in the central region. We have the Asians, we have the uh, Muntaris playing for schools, we have the Deribuatins, etc. There's something we call boots and books. You cannot separate uh, boots from books. You know, even within the Ghana Football Association uh, statutes, it is stipulated that the Ministry of Youth and Sports, GFA, and the Ministry of Education must collaborate to develop school sports. Now, athletics uh, as a country has gone down a bit due to the fact that the premium or the uh, interest in school sports has gone down. And therefore, we need to invest in school sports to be able to develop as a country if we want to take sports to the level we want. Upon completion of the four-phased project, it is expected to have a swimming pool complex, a multi-purpose hand and volleyball court, and other supporting infrastructures such as a gymnasium, washrooms and spectator stands.